guys, welcome to Shopaholic. In my world, this is the world best recipe for one hot sticky chicken. Once you have tasted this chicken, you will never stop making this ever. I love chicken and I've tried many chicken recipes. I seldom cook the same recipe twice, but this, I make this many times and my family, they are nuts about this. So now let me show you how to make this delicious one pot sticky chicken in your own home. First, make the sauce. In a mixing bowl, add some brown sugar, a cinnamon stick, those ginger slice, some dried chili. If you like it to be spicy, you add more. And a few cloves of star arms. And three tablespoons of oyster sauce. You can also use thick mushroom sauce. And one third cup of light soya sauce. Give it a mix. If you like more salty, you can add a little bit more salt. One third cup of water. Brown the chicken on a moderate heated non-stick frying pan. There is enough fat on the chicken soup, so you don't need any oil when browning the chicken. Turn the chicken regularly to avoid being brown, making sure that all the sides are browned properly. When the chicken are brown, add in the seasoning ingredients. Make sure the marinade is enough to cover the surface of the chicken. Cover with the lid and let the simmer for 20 minutes. Open the lid and check the chicken every 5 minutes. Stir the chicken around occasionally. After 15 minutes, the chicken should be cooked through and the sauce should be reduced to a thick glaze like this. For small chicken parts like this, I usually prefer to cook it at least 20 to 25 minutes to ensure that the chicken is cooked through. When the chicken are done, I garnish it with mix, some sliced chili and some sesame seeds. This dish is perfect as a starter. Now it's time to eat. I prefer to serve it with jasmine rice. It's sweet, salty, sour, smoky, super delicious. I get so hungry every time I think about this dish. I hope you guys give this dish a thumbs up. And please don't forget to subscribe, okay? Next time, I will share with you how we spend our Christmas holiday and what we add during that time. Hopefully, we can throw in a few ideas what you can make for the New Year party. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you join us again next time. And take care. Bye.